A multi-sectoral forum on age of consent of sex has rejected the Court of Appeal proposal to lower the age of consent to 16 years. Stakeholders in the forum say lowering the age consent will affect the rights of children who should be allowed to grow in a safe environment. The permanent secretary in the State Department of Gender, Safina Kwekwe, says lowering the age limit will protect sex predators and will lead to the rise of unwanted pregnancies. The National Gender and Equality Commission terms the debate as a weighty issue and the consent age should even be raised above the current age 18 age limit. If you are less than 18, you are a child. If you are above 18, then you, you become the youth. You become an adult who can make decisions. These children cannot make decisions. Remember again, in the Education Act 2013, those children are supposed to have free and compulsory education, basic education, which should end at age 18. We are not reinventing that. Sex education for children and young people and easy access to pornography were identified as main factors that make children experiment with sex since they were not aware of the consequences. The meeting recognized that children have reproductive health rights which give them the right to appropriate information. Information on data on issues related to teenage pregnancies, reproductive and health issue rights for young people who are lacking, making planning, prevention and provision of services a challenge. It's not just about lowering the age for sex, it's about lowering the age for many other things that come attendant with the same. And therefore being blinded by um, the challenge that uh, has enabled us to have this discussion that is sexual offenses are punitive to boys, yet we also know increasingly now that uh, boys are also becoming more and more of victims of sexual, sexual crimes. But most importantly, even when the boy or, uh, uh, is the perpetrator, the law states how that boy should be uh, uh, confined, detained. It's not, it's the failure of our own implementation should not be the reason as to why we say we must lower the age of consent. As a country, I think we are not prepared enough. We are not able to compare ourselves with the developed countries that are are having their girls or are having the consent age given to be 14 years, 13 years, 16 and even below. For us, we should even be mature enough, we should even increase this age so that we see where are we. And then put the structures in place, test those structures and see